Okay, it is currently, it's currently 10 o'clock and I have to go to the dentist office by 11 o'clock. So I have to go ahead and I'm gonna take these two bags to fill up one of my vending machines. We're gonna get there, we're gonna refill it and hopefully we're done by an hour. And this includes the travel time, the taking out the money, everything. So let's see if we can get it done. Okay, got the bags in the car. Yeah. Got my bag in the car. And now you got me in the car. So one of the things that people are always telling me is that vending isn't passive and that it takes a lot of time. But that's what I kind of want to prove to you guys today, that we're going to get this done in an hour. I'm going to make it to my dentist appointment. And that, you know, it can be relatively a good passive idea because all I'm going to do is spend less than an hour. I'm going to do this every two weeks and I'm making 40 to $50 a week. That's more than what most jobs pay for an hourly wage. So let's get going. Let's see what we can do. Let's see if we can make it. I don't even know we're going to make it yet. But yeah, Jesus, 10.07 already. It took me five minutes to get into the car. That is ridiculous. Well, I guess I am filming at the same time too. So I can't be too hard on myself. But yes, hopefully this can show you guys that it is doable. You can have a full-time job. You can still do this. Ooh, where am I going? And that it's okay to be nervous. Sorry, I'm, my phone might be a little shaky everywhere. Point is, it's 10.07. I should be able to make it there in about 15 minutes. Ew, this is not safe. I'll check back in uh, once I actually get there. And once I get there, it should just be easy. I'm only collecting one day's worth. So it's not a big collection or anything. This is just to show you guys that you, know, you can do this in less than an hour. And you could probably also just go to Sam's and, oh, cop. Okay, look at that, it is 10.14. I just got into the parking lot. Yeah. Okay, I think I'm definitely going to be able to make it to my dentist appointment at 11. Let's see, let's see. So, I'll try to do like a little to do like a little mini collection video. It should just be a one day collection, but we'll see.
Okay, it's 10.39. I finished restocking the machines. I would have been a lot faster, but a lot of the people were talking to me and they were actually giving me some really nice suggestions, like to remove the ramen, add a powder donut, add some popcorn. All very useful, so of course I was gonna stay and listen to what they wanted to buy. So, I'm off. I'm gonna go to my dentist. I should be able to make it still. Look at that, in just one hour we restocked our machine. It is now 10.56. Looks like I am gonna make it to my dentist appointment. Now don't go yet. I just need to take up like two more minutes of your time. I, I just wanted to say thank you to everybody who has recently subscribed. You guys are amazing. And I really hope that this video showed you guys that it really doesn't take a lot of time. It, well, okay, it does take a lot of time up front. You have to do a lot of research. You have to figure out what machines to get, find a mover, get a location. And you know, nobody's born with the knowledge of what machine to get, what not to get, and what to do. So yes, up front takes a lot of time. But, but after, afterwards, it should just be two hours a month. And honestly, if it wasn't for me recording and if it wasn't for me talking to the employees, I probably would have been done a lot sooner than the one hour. But I'm just gonna stick it to two hours a month. I'm not gonna shorten it any longer than that. But if you really think about it, who doesn't have two hours a month? We all have our obligations and life can get ridiculously crazy sometimes. And we all have families and probably even multiple jobs at this point. And it can be hard to find time. Yes, I fully understand that. But if you're trying to build something for you or if you need some sort of extra income, I think this could be a good answer. And if it just takes the two hours, remember it's two hours that you decide when to go. There's nobody telling you or yelling at you, go in on a Saturday at 8 a.m. or do this on a Tuesday. You get to tell yourself when you wanna go in and what you wanna do and it's all up to you. That's why I really like the business so far. And I hope you guys took away from that as well and you know that, that that it can be possible so that's it that's that's the final thing i was gonna say if you guys liked the video please like subscribe leave me a comment so far i've been answering every single one of the comments and in the next video i'm going to show you guys my worst product i i kid you not i did not sell a single item of this this entire month and i am going to switch it out but i will be showing you what not to buy because i don't think I don't think anybody should buy it now. I did think it was a good idea. I did think it was gonna work, but I was wrong. Bye, bye guys.